public meetings and door to door campaigns are among the strategies village chiefs in Malawi, like John Sanganiza, are using to mobilize villagers to get vaccinated. Here, the chiefs defuse myths that link COVID 19 vaccine to infertility and the allegations that the vaccine is the government's ploy to depopulate the country. I gave them an example that there is a life-prolonging drug, ARVs. If the government wanted to reduce the population by killing people, it could have used ARVs. But now, many people are taking ARV, but they are not dying. During the campaigns, chiefs accompany mobile vaccination clinics where villagers are voluntarily vaccinated against COVID-19. The effort started in July as part of a year-long program funded by the European Civil Protection and Humanitarian Aid Operations. A consortium of eight NGOs, including Go Malawi, is working to scale up vaccine uptake in rural Malawi. In the chief person's area of 11 villages, about 500 of 1,200 adults have now been vaccinated. I have long been refusing to get vaccinated because of what some people are saying, that vaccines will make me infertile. So as a lady, my fear was that I won't have children, but I have realized that this is not true because some ladies who are vaccinated are able to have children. With a population of nearly 20 million, only 800,000 people in Malawi have received at least one dose of the vaccine far, far short from the country's target of vaccinating 11 million people by December this year. The low uptake is largely attributed to misconceptions about the safety and effectiveness of the vaccine. However, project implementers say working with the chiefs have helped change their perception because villagers trust the chiefs. And also noticing that uh, chiefs uh, their local leaders are also getting uh, the job right in the community. That is also a very powerful encouragement to the community members. So we have noticed uh, a very big shift in terms of figures and the uptake in areas where we are supporting and running this uh, project. Malawi government health authorities held the project. So I could see some people were coming in for the vaccination because of the, their chiefs of the mobilization of the chiefs. So this also assisted us and it increased the uptake of the vaccine. Maybe up to, it contributed to at least 15 to 20 percent. Project implementers say some villagers shy away from the public meetings because they think they'll be forced to get the job. However, that challenge is overcome by a door-to-door -door campaign where elderly villagers are voluntarily vaccinated right at their doorstep. Lamek Masina for VOA News, Blanta, Malawi.